Hey guys, just wanted to do a short video. Um, I know some of you know I've been working on end phase inverters, working with wind turbines, and um, I finally got it to work uh, pretty well, at least with one inverter right now. I'm going to stack them and see how that works out. But this is a uh, HY1000 24 volt wind max wind turbine, and it's tied to an M250 end phase grid tied inverter. And as we all know, there is no UL inverters for small wind, so I'm trying to give this a go. Um, one more time here, and it seems like I've got it down pretty good. Uh, I got 16 miles an hour of top watts was about 200 watts out of the one inverter. So what I wanted to show here was wind speed, AC watts, and the volts. So you can kind of see, um, you know, when this thing starts up and when it produces power. Uh, we don't have huge winds, but they're good enough winds to show um, production coming from the inverter, and it can be done. It's just a matter of a lot of um, circuitry and thinking and <laughs> tons of testing. So right now you can see we're just under the 20 volt mark, uh, five miles an hour, and we have no production. So as it rises up here a little bit, we're at six miles an hour, just around 20 volts. Nothing happening yet. Of course, the wind always dies down when you're trying to do something like this. There we go. Here comes some wind. Now, as long as the wind stays up there, you know, we'll be producing watts. So I don't want to bore you to death too much, uh, but that's what I got going on so far. Hopefully we'll get some stronger winds in here and uh, I can show full production out of this inverter. Uh, but it does work well. The MPPT works on it. As you can see, the voltage is rising and it loads and it pulls it back down. If the wind picks up, the, uh, the volts will go back up again. So it's working just like a regular grid tied inverter, man. And I do have a dump load on here uh, connected to the system to protect the inverter. So we don't have to worry about blowing the inverter up or overvolting it. Uh, however, I have overvolted it and it didn't do anything to it. So that's a good thing. So there you go. In phase M250, making a little bit of watts. This might be a good thing for all us uh, wind turbine guys that have low voltage turbines. We might be able to now have a UL inverter uh, that can work with our system. All right, so a little bit of info there. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll keep you guys posted. Take care.